stop with the nominees, you see. I don't think there should be a winner. Because like, right now, nobody's a loser. You see? And then you'll have another 30 seconds, so you're going to be a bunch of losers. Hello everyone, welcome back. We're late for the Leos. I just want to take a couple of seconds, get my two bits in before shit gets crazy on the carpet. We were here last night, and yes, everybody's excited, everybody's happy, celebrating BC film and television, but everyone's also paying their quiet respects for the passing of a titan. I was nominated for a number of things, and actually a number of things, but I also <laughs> was given um, the Lifetime Achievement Award, which is, you know, kind of frightening because you think, what do you mean? I'm, <laughs> now I got I like do? another 50 years, like, don't I? We're all dying, but I have chosen a life without cancer. <laughs> you better believe it. But I've been happier in that life. I, I, I just don't think so. I didn't really know Babs. I met her a couple times in the red carpet, spoke to her inside. But when she spoke, I listened. <laughs> There's not many that can say that. This is not your first episode with Shoot Me Now, though. It absolutely is not. We have a long, loving relationship. Somebody needs to shoot all the turmoil of us getting there, of all of this. You really blossomed as a designer. Thank you so much. We put a lot of work into it, and to grow with the Leos as well. They just get bigger and better every year, and we're always so happy to be a part of that. We're here with Sonia. You're the host for this evening. Yes, indeed. So is this your first hosting event? Yeah, yeah. I don't really know what the hell I'm doing, but it's gonna be good! I don't know what I'm doing either. Is there any advice that you can give me for a hosting team? Keep it short and sweet. Great, right, and that's Sonia, everyone. Thanks very much. I know what everybody's thinking. First, who the is Benjamin Arthur? <laughs> I have never hosted anything, no. I've presented a couple awards at the Gemini's. You've been nominated for a Leo before, is that right? What is that category? Just the best category? Yeah, I'm under <laughs> best. I have, I'm actually up again tonight. I just kidnapped Sonny and Andy, and we're on the red carpet right now. You must be a little bit. It is? That's what that's what's going on right now. Andy did a great job. We got all the stars lined up here. We've got you. We've got good weather. What more do you want? So what kind of celebrities are we going to see here tonight? Oh, Sonny note them all. Well, we've got Lou Diamond Phillips of La Bamba fame and many other things, of course. Uh, we have Kristen Crook. We have Amanda Tapping uh, from Stargate and now Sanctuary. So we have a lot of great stars here tonight. Wow, this is crazy. Nominated for anything, this is the first time at, I'm at an awards show. You were just amazed. Yeah, it was pretty shocking. I like being in this position more now, though. I'm just like, I'm just presenting, it's cool. I don't have to stress about like winning or, or going on stage and yeah, with a speech or whatever. I think you're in the wrong business, maybe. No, okay, you know what? People think that acting and public speaking is the same thing. Not true, it's not. They're like worlds apart. You're always the type of guy to be like alternative and not mainstream. If you're saying that I cuss a lot, then yes, I, I've been known to drop a lot of F-bombs. Just here to glitter? I'm here for the glitterati, yes. Uh, but I also am presenting tonight. No, I'll tell you, I started really late. I didn't get my first uh, paying uh, film and TV gig until I was about 26. What, like 27 now? Yeah, it's been just a blur. It's just a whirlwind. Uh, it's, uh, it's crazy. It's been a crazy year and a half, I tell you. I have two lines. I have a professional line and then I have an evening wear. So the professional line is of course something you can dress up to go out for work, but it's also a cocktail line. Suave, no suave in line. I, I noticed that you go you go more brown, blonde. Yeah, the series we're actually doing, they don't want us to look identical, so they're making us change our looks a little bit, but I do get that I'm better looking. And uh, you're the producer for the show tonight, is I'm that right? The associate producer for the Leos. Yeah, last year we hosted, and yeah. this is my second year in a producer capacity. Do I get a gift bag? Uh, are you a presenter? <clears throat> uh, I could be. Oh, have, your, have your people call our people, and uh, we'll. I know what that means. All right, guys. I heard you guys met on the red carpet. Is that true? 
Yeah, we met just two minutes ago at the end of the red carpet, actually. Love is in the air, everyone. Such a coincidence, neither one of us had a date tonight. I mean, nobody was talking to me before I got Gretel on my arm, so... Honestly, we're just both so happy to be here. He was probably going to give you a funny answer, but... <laughs> yeah, if she wins, I'll just take all the credit for it. You're the funny one and you're the dramatic one? Is that it? Actually, acting-wise, she's very funny. Uh, but, yeah, yeah. But, uh, but not in but not life. In real just life. not in real life. Well, you know, we just snuck in here from the high school graduation. Is we that were, why you guys all dressed yeah, up? That's we, were, we were prom king and queen. Oh. We're very proud. Oh, I could tell. We have one more. <laughs> Cat Birch presents. I turned down CSI Miami, by the way. God damn it. <laughs> I'd rather fucking work in BC. <laughs> so I have one more candy. I'd like to thank the uh, nominated committee of the Leos. I will keep my pants on. Yes. <laughs> I just have to do a little tribute to that. I promised Jordan that I would do this. <laughs> you know where your lips are. She taught me to put my lipstick on without looking in the mirror. And I probably missed. <laughs> I haven't eaten really well. Leo's. Walter, I'm going to wreck this place. Okay, let the dinner begin soon. This is not uh, an award that belongs to one person. This is the cumulative effort of an army of people that resulted in me standing up here tonight. The whole whole family was amazing. Um, I felt like a risk on, on um, hiring me for the role. And, uh, you know, these people, they brought me in and they gave me a try and, and it worked. And, uh, yeah. <laughs> to our amazing crew who not only come to work every day and assemble our show for us, but they also create a safe environment for us to do what we do. So this award belongs to you guys. When you're a woman my age, in this industry, finding this the roles that, that uh, resonate becomes more and more difficult. And uh, as we get older and uh, once our cheeks grow up and, and, and our tits sag, <laughs> we are just hitting our stride. Now we need room to swing, and I am grateful for it. And thank you for saving people. Thank you to everyone at Sanctuary. It's, uh, it's a great, great show to work on. Um, Amanda, Damien, and Martin. It's just uh, <clears throat> so cool. My beautiful girlfriend who puts up with all my childishness and has managed not to stab me yet. <laughs> to my ma, Amida, who, um, when I wanted to drop out of school to pursue acting, uh, my dad said, school. Fuck school. So, uh, that. If there's one thing that I uh, appreciate and love more than anything and anyone is someone who's really passionate about what they do. And uh, I met Mark Schroeder, our director, over at dinner. He was so passionate about it, I knew the next day I'd have to try to talk to him. This award uh, is really what separates us from the Jessies. <laughs> well, thank Walter for the board. Um, First time in Canada that we get a category for stunt coordinators. Yeah. I got the first one. And the Leo goes to. Don't make me take you down. Yeah? You can say it. I do, sorry. SGB? Yeah. SGB! 